Hi Calgary residents, uh, back again with uh, Cool Polka's case. Um, this case showed up in the award this week and the pictures were taken by Tay. This is not uh, just a teaching case, I'm actually also interested if anybody has different comments because there are some images here that we found a little bit tough to interpret. So the patient was a young woman who showed up in the OR with an incredibly distended abdomen and uh, there was significant uh, difficulty with ventilating her. Uh, the first images that we saw were these. And my first impression really is just uh, that there's really a lot of fluid here. You can see kind of fluid lines in the tissue and then these lung um, sort of almost confluent B lines with not a lot of movement on the uh, uh, pleura so kind of difficult ventilating not, not a lot, lot of lung movement um, a lot of fluid there And then on our next picture, we, we had this um, kind of image where it, and, and it almost looks like a long point. Uh, so uh, this was kind of zone three. And uh, so Tay was wondering if there was some kind of pneumothorax, but I think looking at the image that probably what we're seeing here is more a lung transition zone where we have lung collapse in this area and pleural effusion with more normal lung pushing down onto that collapsed zone. And again, so lower down in the lung here. So this is now zone four. We see very little movement. So these clear pleural effusions, a separation of the visceral and parietal pleural fluid, and this almost tissue-like lung just sitting below it. Um, this is what that looked like in M mode. So at times it looks like lung, and then at times it doesn't. So it, it does look like lung point M mode. But again, I think it's not long point between a pleural, um, between a pneumothorax and normal lung. I think this is collapsed lung with pleural effusion and more normal lung. This is what we saw um, on the cardiac echo. So very uh, hyperdynamic cardiac with this fluid behind it. We were a little bit challenged to think where was this fluid, but I think where this actually is, just in terms of how the image is shot, is that this is um, likely ascites uh, versus plural. Um, but yeah, interested in other people's opinions on this too. Uh, just a very interesting case with lots of good information there with the B lines, um, the pleural effusion, and the tissue like lung, and then uh, this hyperdynamic heart. So uh, thank you for watching and. Uh, Continue to focus on your focus. See you in the hour.